I have a question for the whole wide world. Who among you will take disrespect from creature, man, beast, woman, spirit, dog, anything, when God don't disrespect you? Which one of you will take someone talking crazy to you and just take it and not say nothing for the disrespect? Why do people run at the voice of people who hate people for nonsense reasons and they just run to go try to hurt somebody or fight somebody or do something evil to somebody when God told them not to. Most people run because of a slit between somebody's legs. Many kingdoms have fallen because of someone find, falling blindly something that some evil woman said. Are you waiting on me? Yes, ma'am, we are. Or some evil man said. Who? Who will allow someone to do evil to them or do evil to their people and just take it? But because I'm saved, y'all expect me to just take it. Where do that at? Everybody in the world was not always saved. Humans were born to err. They were born to make mistakes. But who would take insurrection, disrespect, dishonor from anyone and just take it? There are people in this world that make me sick and they make God sick too because they sit there and listen to anything somebody says and run with it. Instead of saying, okay, how it happened? What was said? What did you do? I'm the kind of person who want to know what my people did too because ain't nobody perfect but God, homie. Someone said someone struck me in a store. Like, so I'm trying to figure out, did it happen or not, before I make any moves. The woman sparked up something talking to people saying, and our ex-son over here, on Navico, have said dark skin girl, like, uh, how who gonna know when they ain't get the ASS whoop? Okay, anybody can run up and run up and punch somebody and steal somebody away. Anybody can run up and shoot somebody and steal somebody away. Oh, that's easy. That ain't nothing. But can they come straight man on man on? That's the question. When you in that cell, you ain't got nowhere to run. When you in that cell, you ain't got no homies. When you everywhere you at, you can't just sneak everything. Me? If I have an art with somebody, I'd rather talk about it first. See what's going on. See what happened. Especially when I know that person don't go around starting no trouble. I'll ask even my old lady. I don't care if she's my wife. I'll ask, what did you say? What did you do? Especially if I know she's messy. What did you say? What did you do? How did it happen? People go around hating people because of lockup. Because maybe they had a fight with somebody over here. Maybe because of this and that and the third, but they don't even know whether a person did something wrong or not. Me, I only want to know the truth of what happened in that store. I felt no pain. If I got hit, I didn't know. I've been fighting pretty much all my life because I had no choice. I chose the most high and I choose to live right. But I have evil people that keep on trying to go against me with their mouths. And I wish God by his people would silence their mouths. Then their actions towards a messenger is becoming rottenness, putrid and violent. In this land, in other lands, they do not respect spirituality. They do not respect the most high at all. They don't get the most high, no love. You know King Chef at? Yes, sir. Right around that corner, brother. Right there. But they don't respect anything about God. They don't respect anything about God's people. They let people tell them one thing and they just run with it. They never ever ask, man, what really happened? They always talking about, hey, uh, my old, my girl said this, or they come and swing on you. Oh, my homeboy said this, I'm gonna take up the fight. Take up the fight for what? 
when you know they they wrong. When you know you wrong. People always pick Nick picking at wars. Like like bumps on their face. Like they're trying to bust a pimple. You always nick picking wars. That when it's spilled over, you can't contain it. You tell my God, why? In other countries, they're killing and slaughtering babies, women. Women don't even have rights. They taking what they want from y'all. Men don't have rights. They kicking in your door saying, what up? And shooting you down and cutting your head off. Like I said. One time I was labeled an international threat to the world because I knew too much. And I was telling too much that's what I shouldn't know. When God reveals things, he reveals it. But I learned some things the world are not supposed to know. I've learned some things you can't tell them for they will not listen. I've learned you can't pray for some people. I've learned you gotta let God handle business. I learned you can't step in the gap to help people all the time. I've learned you can't try to help nobody all the time. I've learned when people disrespect you, they think it's free, and you say something, they want to get mad. Want to send people to try to jump you. Want to send people to try to shoot you. They want to send evil towards you. I've learned there's a lot of evil in this world that need to be vacated, recompensed, and destroyed. What happened to the old church? What happened to the one who say, you either do right or die because of the evil of people? What happened to, hey, the death penalty? What happened to that? What happened to true lawfulness? That's one time when the church was in power, power amongst this land. And people sent evil people to come do evil to people who only try to do right. If somebody talked to you wrong, would you just take it or would you say something back? If somebody said something to you disrespectful, would you say something like, hold up? Or would you just take it? That's the question. No, you wouldn't. You wouldn't take it. People need to ask their people what they done first. Don't just run up on somebody because of what you heard. What did they do? I had an old lady in the past told me somebody slapped her, but get what I found out. She slapped them first. Hate to say it back in the day, but you, you, you deserve that. That painting, you deserve. You should have never slapped that person because they all both talking back and forth. You shouldn't have done it. A real king, a real soldier, a real messenger seeks, seeks out a situation first. Find out what happens first. Want to learn what's going on first before they go running in to start a war that will never end. That's what we do. We think. You don't just go running into a war. Then people are like, I don't like how he talk to me. Forget that. I'm going to set him up. I'm going to show him. I'm going to get some people to clutch him. I'm going to get some people to do this to him, do that to him. Get what? There is a God, and coronavirus ain't gone yet. All the evil these people are doing, and they wonder why they're dying so fast. The coronavirus is going to keep changing and mutating. The more evil they do, it's going to change more and more and more and more and get stronger and 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 stronger till there is 10% of humans left because of the evil that they do. They attack people they shouldn't attack. They start with people they shouldn't start. You're following the beast, things that God are against. A woman say something, you come running. But never, never look at the person that they're talking about. You never come to see is it right or wrong would you take somebody talking to you crazy or would you say something in return like you're not going to talk to me like that 
when you're only asking a question, but they get mad at you and start woofing at you. How would you accept that? How? Would you let somebody talk to you crazy without saying something in return? Would you take it? I don't think so. I see the troops rallying against the prophet, against holiness right now. On Navajo Road between McVeigh. This is what's going on. They rallying together for evil, to do evil. Looking for evil to do, always looking for evil to do, but never want to do good. Never want to do good, but always looking for evil to do. <laughs> what say you? Would you allow evil to be done freely to you if you knew that it was about to be done? Would you allow cowardice people gathering together against you without you doing something or gathering people together as well? What say you? Choose which you know are adversaries. And this is the place in which it happened. The owner usually stays in peace with me. He usually does. Yes, he does. He knows my name very well. He respects me. That's the reason why I wasn't kicked off this land where I could not come back. Because he knows me. I don't go around starting mess. I don't go around being disrespectful to people. At all. But this is the kind of thing I deal with. This is the kind of stuff the messenger deals with. This is the kind of unholy insurrection I deal with. This is the kind of evil I deal with. This is the kind of thing I deal with all the time. People are coming against me who only serve the beast. They say they love God, but they're constantly serving the beast. They say somebody went against them, but they didn't. They went against them, so they spoke their mind. They were the ones that are wrong. They are the ones that are evil, but yet still they go against a the messenger. They constantly go against messengers. Constantly. All that evil. All that evil, man. All that evil, people do. But yet still they're afraid of the coronavirus, but they're still doing evil. How you doing, soldier? Been a long time. And then, nobody's being tough. So I don't know where all the evil coming from with that. I serve the most high. I just spoke my mind on what was real. Would you do the same? There's no tough in here. That's just real. But people let people lie to them and they run with it. They never think, where's the kingship? Where's the kingship? Why, why aren't we thinking? Where's the thinking? Why isn't anyone thinking? No one's using their brain. Anybody can sneak somebody away. Anybody can do something, something weak, and, and that's easy. That, that's easy. Anyone, anyone can jump somebody, that's easy. That's nothing. That's easy. But who can stand holy? Who can stand for God? Why are they so scared to die? Why are they so scared to live for God? Huh? Why are they so afraid to live for God? What up, my brother? It's been a minute. Got enemies going against me. You know how it is. But you see how God is going to work all this out. There's so many people around other countries and around other worlds that are even here in this country. But they tell people I'm doing people evil and I'm not. Somebody went against me and I told them the truth where they were wrong at. Am I wrong? They expect you to bow down and bend over. Would you? People expect you to kiss they behind. Would you? No. Ask them that I curse them out. They can't lie and say that. I just asked the question. Where is the footage 
so I can know whether somebody actually hit me or not. Whether I know somebody attacked me or not. The manager, the boss, we all right for, most part, for the most part. Yeah. But people lying on people, trying to gather people together for evil, it ain't right. When they know I serve the most high. No one should talk to anyone disrespectful. No one should treat anyone wrong for no reason. They gather all these troops against a holy man for no reason. They know me as Big Bear, Preacher Man, Prophet Divine Angel, PD Angel. My name is legendary. I don't go around hurting people. I treat everybody with respect, but yet still they follow the beast the moment the beast says something wrong about a person. Curse be unto you all for all the evil in what you do. May God render and may God repay. May God render and God repay. People seek to do evil for every art. Let he without sin cast the first stone. Let he who never done evil in their lives, who are born from a woman, if you can't cast God down from heaven, if you can't cast God down from heaven, don't cast me down. If you can't hurt God Almighty, don't hurt his messenger. Stop trying to set people up for evil. And you don't even know you're the one siding with evil. You don't even know you, you're so blind by the, by the, by the pretty butt in the, in the small waist of, of these women and these different people uh, and your homies that you can't even see you the one on the bad side. You think you coming to be a hero to help somebody who do is in the right. Man, they playing you, man. You being played, bro. You being played. Sometimes you got to stand up and say, daughter, well, you the one being evil? Everybody know this man is a good dude. What's going on? You got to ask, well, you the one being evil? What did you do? You got to ask the question. You can't just stand there and just keep on letting insurrection and evil keep happening. And most of the brothers see you who walking up. And they point at who, who it is. They're like, hold up, man. Ain't that all? Wait a minute. What's going on? Nah, no, he don't do like nothing like that. They know I don't bother nobody. I don't bother nobody unless they bother me. I don't disrespect nobody. Somebody talking about talking hard, all that hard stuff. Bro, I don't go around talking hard, bro. I don't got to. Talking hard is not being hard. Am I hard? No. Am I gangster? No, them days are gone. Do I thug? No. But I stand with the most high strong. And I don't give up. And I stand for those who stand with me. That's what I stand for. You got people lying and putting all kinds of lies and, and, and putting the deal you took with no evidence against you out there behind. And you trying to free your name and clear yourself right now. But yet still, they constantly letting people go against you. Trying to find ways to go against you. God will render and God will repay. God will render and God will repay. God will render and God will slay. One thing about it, it says in the word, evil shall hunt down the violent man. That means violent woman too. All the evil that's spitting. All the evil they talking. And talking about somebody talking hard. Who know about me going around talking hard? Nah, I talk real. I speak real. I'm about real. I'm real. They expect you to just shut your mouth and not say nothing to their disrespect. Everyone around the world, you know me. I'm the real PD Angel. Prophet Divine Angel. I am preacher man and I yet live. Yes. Nanny Goat. Going through problems out here, bro. Big Willie. Five life sentences. Mafia. I'm going through it, bro. Out here, bro. Godfather. It's been a long time, sir. I tell you, Mafia. It's been a long time. Those brothers and I. Yeah, overseas, Pakistan, all them right there, yeah, even Russia. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for the love in the past, some of y'all. I thank you.
China, Japan, thank you. I'm also divine and I do live. I am here. But people are gathering people against me right now. They're constantly gathering them and they're trying to find a way to set me up for things that they heard, but they have not heard from me. They did not sit there to listen to what I have to say. They're sneaking around, trying to find ways to get close to me so they can strike. Instead of asking the question, what it is, what it ain't, what it could be, they run with it. And I've been talking to one of them now who's been brainwashed. How you doing, sir? You was just at that store, right? Yeah, what? I know these people at the shop, they're my friends. Okay, watch this look. I ain't watching this store. No, no, you good, you good, you good. I ain't worried about, I ain't, I ain't taking you, dog. Just please listen to me. It's something you need to know. What's that? I took a deal with no evidence against me. And the whole world knows it. I even missed Donald Trump when he was the president and asked him when he clear my name like he clearing other people. Hmm. I asked him about, I told him about Jesus. God figured he had a right to know about Jesus Christ as well. People tell me I'm talking hard, bro. I just speak my mind in the truth. And I see you from where I'm from, too. You from Lock Up. I can tell. Huh? I can see you from where I'm from. You from Lock Up. I can tell. Sometimes real soldiers, we actually think about a matter. I just got home. And we listen to a matter. Don't let nobody cross you up, man. Don't listen to them, bro. I serve God in Jesus' name, man. Have wolves get across. And I can tell by your tattoos and soldiers. School? You ain't cool with these folks. Oh, no, I'm cool with them. These my people. I know them. This right here? Yeah, I'm Big Bear, preacher man. Yeah, the prophet. Yeah, it's me. Yeah. Tell them I got some cash money. I was wondering why this But When you want it? Man. In the morning? Bet that. If look. They, if they run. Go over there. I know they run. I know them personally. They're my friend and friends. Look. Go over there to that ex son. I mean, that store right there you was at. When you seen all that evil about me? Go over there. And I want you to write your number down and write the situation. I'll write you who you are, you want, what you gonna do. And put in that box right there, man. They'll serve you in the morning. They'll serve you in the morning. They'll serve you in the morning, bro. Brother, I don't smoke, drink, or anything. That's the God in me, man. He'll take it away from you, too. He'll move it. Don't worry. Yeah, he was in. The uh, Chevron 2 station right there. Well, this woman is gathering people against me. The fat one behind the counter. And the dark skinned one is talking as well. When they have no reason to. I told them I'm not your enemy. Niggas tell me I'm talking hard. I didn't they keep talking hard. Nah, 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 sir. Don't cross me. I'm not a nigga, for one. I'm an intelligent black man who believe in the most high. So please don't cross me up with you and your kind. But I will respect the fact that you are human. But don't disrespect me. I will speak my mind to you as well. You are a man that don't make no difference. Even if you got a gun in my face, you can ask other people, I will speak my mind. I'm gonna tell you the truth. Wrong is wrong and right is right. But people keep doing evil to people but yet still, they don't want their people to die of coronavirus. People keep doing evil to people, but when somebody gets shot, they land on the ground and bleeding, they want to say, oh, my people, oh, they were good. Okay, they were good, but they robbing and murdering and stealing and raping and killing and, and doing everything they, they can do that's against God, but yet still, they gonna say they love God. How can you love God and go against God's people, man? I'm confused. How can you love God and go against God's people? You go against his own. I, 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 don't, I don't get it. God said, you love me, then keep my commandments, man. God said, you love me, that's him. God, most high. If you love him, keep his commandment, man. What type of time y'all on? And most of this, my own color keep going against me are people who've been influenced by the nigger let and the nigger syndrome. Those are the ones going against me, man. 
Then they're dragging other people into hell and they hell this situation with their mom. And they mouth. They got too much evil going, bro. Too much evil going. And they expect coronavirus not to take them out someday. Or not take out their people or their children. They, they expect coronavirus not slaughtering nothing away. They think the vaccine has healed everything. Oh, we so glorious. We beat the hand of God. No, the reason why it ain't going to work because it's the hand of God. Then more storms are coming. It's going to get worse. It's not going to end. The world and the earth is trying to shake your evil off. The earth itself is trying to shake your darkness and evil off because you only seek to slaughter what God love. You only seek to destroy what God said don't do. You only seek to press insurrection and disrespect. Same sex marriage, marriages, I'm gonna be honest with you. God said no. It's a stench to his nostril. You can hate me if you want to. Man and man ain't supposed to be together. Woman and woman ain't supposed to be together. I'm sorry. I don't care how they say, oh, you can still serve God. I know somebody who liked that and I told him, look, you, you, you gay, sister. I love you as a person, but I would never agree with your life. I'll never agree with your life because God said don't. If I agree with your life and I'm happy at what you do, then I'm about the same curse. Are you crazy? I'm not going against no God. If my mortal body die, then I die. But I'm not going against God. If my mortal body die, if I die, I'm not going against God. I refuse to go against the most high. I refuse to leave God even if I die. I refuse to walk the way of my enemies. I refuse to walk the way of hell. I refuse to live the way of a demon. I refuse to let go of who God is and who God made me. I refuse. Even if I die, I got heaven. I'm not gonna die. If I die physically, you can't take heaven from me. If you can't pull God down from heaven, Stop trying to yank me down. Stop trying to kill me. Stop trying to kill others. Stop trying to destroy me. It's going to be a war coming. And I ain't going to have nothing to do with it. But the most high is what you're fighting against. You're fighting against God. And you keep on trying. You keep on talking evil about his people. You keep on trying to destroy God's people. And you think you're not going to pay? The storms are coming. The blessed pestilence. The curse is here. And it ain't done. God is going to wipe all of your evil out of hell. Because you constantly attack his servant with your tongue like a serpent. Like a snake. You constantly destroy. You constantly devise evil in your mind and your heart. And you want to live. You want my God to bless you and your family. But yesterday you try to curse me. A messenger. Read his word. Read Jeremiah. Start at Jeremiah 12. And see will you not fear the Lord. Your God. That you refuse to return yourself unto him. But you constantly devise evil. Because somebody told you to. Are you just a follower? Because somebody told you to do evil, you're gonna do it? That's it? You, you, you don't have a mind of your own? You're doing evil, you're evil. It's point blank, it's over, you evil dog. You evil. You can't say, oh yeah, God good, yeah, God all right. You can't scream God all right and doing evil and sneaking around trying to do evil. You evil, man. Why are you evil? God is not going to let you into heaven eating booty. God is not going to let you into heaven eating coochie if you're a woman. God is not going to let you into heaven stroking nothing. I'm behind. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
I gotta tell you the truth. I got I got people that's like that. I'm sorry, but I'm telling y'all the truth from my heart. Oh my God, I feel sorry. I'm scared for you. Cause I try. You can't say I never tried to tell you the truth. You can't say I never tried to tell you the truth, man. You cannot say that preacher man ain't never tried to tell you the truth. You just wouldn't hear it. You wouldn't listen. You wouldn't pay attention. Does God have to uproot every building in America for y'all to pay attention? Does God have to drop a, house, a tree on your house for you to pay attention? Is that what God got to do? Do God got to bring a storm that wipe everything off the face of the earth? Do you got to strike out with another country and they blow this place up with a nuclear bomb for you to understand God real? God said stop attacking his people. God said stop attacking his people, man. The God of Israel, Holy God, messengers, yes. But yet still you do it. You go around doing all that evil, but you praying, oh Lord, help me. Please save my family of Corona from Corona. But you listen to another, a woman instead of God. A evil woman instead of God. Instead of God, man. You don't listen to God. You don't do nothing he say. If you don't do nothing your daddy or mama say, they ain't give you nothing. You say, mama, I need some money uh, for a car. Your mama gonna tell you, get out of her face because you didn't do what she said. That's the same way God is, bro. God the same way, homie. For real. When you was in that cell, you prayed, didn't it? When you was in that cell, you humble. Do we all gotta be locked up to be humble? Do we all gotta be locked up to do what God say, man? Do we all gotta be locked up to do what God say? Is that what it take? Is that what it take? It never take for a law to go around busting everybody they can bust just for y'all to leave me alone. It never to take. It never to take. They take God, let coronavirus kill everything for everybody to leave me alone in peace. Is that what it take? God, really, man? Is that what it take? Look, my people have wolves get a broad black. The only time we really got along, man, it's sad, bro, is when we was in slavery. I hate to say it, but maybe God needs to send us back to slavery. Maybe we'll be humble. Maybe all us become humble. I remember there was a time men wouldn't just listen to what a woman say. They'll search a matter out first. See what's going on first. Go talk to that person first, and then they'll check the situation. Real men don't just run because a woman said something that somebody said. Real men don't do that. Lord God, I pray unto heaven. Let us all go back into slavery so we can go come back together as a people if that's what it takes. Father, I want you to bring, I want you to bring, Father, I want you to bring God in Jesus' name, how we get a bride. Bring it, bring it, bring the military thing, please. Bring the new world order, please. So they will bow to their knees and break down like they did in slavery. To you, we have to go back into slavery to know God, to see God. We need martial law. President Biden, they have become totally corrupt in America. We need martial law. We need to go back into slavery to come back together. We need to go back into slavery to come back together. We need it. All my people never will. Bring the mandate back. Lock them in. Put military on every corner. It's a war out here, an urban war. And they're not stopping, man. It's getting more evil, more evil, and more evil, and more evil. Coronavirus ain't enough. Father God, God, coronavirus is not enough. You have to bring more. Father, God, bring more curses. 
so your people will return holy. Pain bring us together. Hurt bring us together. Bondage bring us together. I got people gathering people against me right now for speaking my mind because the person was wrong. Father, bring the curse. Bring more curses worse than coronavirus. Father God, if you have to slaughter us all, then make it so for me to have peace. If you gotta bring a hurricane to wipe everything out of existence, if you gotta bring more coronavirus, Father, do it. Because we will not be in peace with each other until we are in bondage again. Please, God, in Jesus' name, I pray. I pray. Please. You told me not to pray for these people no more, Father. I see why. I see why. And I repent in Jesus' name for not wanting to listen to you because of the heart I had for people. Father, Rip my heart out that I have and make it only for you. So my heart won't be foolish. I was passing the word to a man and he just tried to disrespect me. And I asked the woman what's going on, what happened, how it happened. And she won't even tell me. Father. 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 Everyone, to the president, to the vice president, these lands have become spoiled and evil. No one listens to what you say that is right. No one listens to the God of Israel and what you have placed upon these waters. No one cares. They have all turned evil. They always are always trying to find a way to destroy me because a deal I took with no evidence against me. But I'm trying my best to clear my name. And I'm trying to live free and holy. The more people I hurt, I wouldn't say hurt, forgive me. The more people I help, the more hurt I receive. The more disrespect I receive. How long will people stand blindly to see a messenger be destroyed by name, by quota, and by situation. How long? In an unlawful land that has become totally unlawful, that evil people go against them, sodomites come against him, but yet still they turn a blind eye. How long? Certain people sneak up to try to destroy because of what they've been told. How long? How long will you let this insurrection happen? How long? How long will you let this evil happen? How long? How long will you let this darkness happen? How long? If your bike can fit in, I'll give you a ride. All right. He said, he all right, it's just a little rain. He about to go home. I tried to help that brother, but I respect his wishes. That one there can tell you everything that was said about me. All the evil that was spoken about me, he can tell you. Everyone who wants to live right, look for him and ask him what happened. Look for her as well and ask her what happened for real in that store. Thank you. Footage is already gone. My brother couldn't help me with that. But you can find out what really happened. Thank you.